Yeah, we spoke to a lot of parents at this Adams School District school today. They have a lot of questions, they have a lot of concerns. One of them being, will their children be able to go to the same school next year? A major shakeup in Adams School District 14. The district has lost its accreditation status. A major reorganization will now take place. A spokesperson told us the district thought it was making required changes. Then arbitrarily out of nowhere, the state board changed the rules of the game, setting up conditions to justify punishments that neither serve the interests of the district nor its students. Adams 14 said it was following guidelines set by the state to improve academic performance and test scores. It even hired a new superintendent. Our superintendent has worked in some of the most challenging school districts in America and has boosted results for its most vulnerable populations time after time. Adams 14 said removing accreditation unfairly targets children of color, second language learners and underserved communities. Many of the district schools are in Commerce City, a predominantly Latinx community. Y pues, ellos están impuestos aquí a esta escuela. This parent saying he's afraid his child's home school will be changed under a new reorganization plan. There's fear of what happens next. We have meetings sometimes, but we don't get uh, on time that information in, in about it, what is gonna be. The district says no decisions to make changes have been made. The failure to meet state standards in Adams 14 now makes it one of the most closely watched districts in the state. We're being told all of the Adams schools will remain open throughout this process. There will be public hearings, and at some point, a public vote on the proposed changes. In Commerce City, Vicente Adanas, Fox 31.